I was in a tent. And the weather had broken and the monsoons were just pouring out of the sky. And we had about 14 men under a tent fly, if you can imagine that, uh, trying to sleep after a heavy day's work. And uh, I got this blasted ulcer on in the middle of my left foot. And it just ached and ached and ached. And I thought it couldn't possibly get worse when all of a sudden I got a dreadful pain in my right toe, in the middle of the right foot. I realised I'd probably been bitten by something and I scrubbled the uh, bit of bed clothing that I had over my foot and sort of tied up whatever was there and I rolled around for the rest of the night with pain in my right, pain in my right f f toe. I can laugh about it in the past, in the present, but it wasn't funny then. I lost all the pain that was just sort of aching, aching, aching in my left foot and suddenly this dreadful pain in this right foot and I, I was in, if you can imagine, 14 men under a tent fly, under pouring rain, not comfortable. And I, the rest of the morning, I got this pain in the right foot. Dawn came and I cautiously took the things off the foot that I'd thumped on and as I did, an enormous centipede ran off. I'd been bitten by, by a bloody centipede. <laughs> and, and it was worse than the, the, worse than the pain on, I had in the left foot. But by then my pain had come back. And um, we had this huge walk every day up a, almost a 45 degree for over, well over a mile. And uh, anyway, in due course, the Australian doctors, we had two Australian doctors in the camp, one wonderful fellow from Sydney, and uh, he was the sort of fellow that made you feel as though he... Uh, uh, well, it made you, he made you feel good just by talking to you, and uh, he made you feel made you feel as though he was being paid thousands of dollars for the, any operation he might do on you. And he, uh, he said, I'm sorry, Mr Goodwin, but uh, um, I think the only way to treat that foot is to take the toe off. So he immediately set to and... Uh, I don't know what sort of anaesthetic he gave me, if any, and uh, he took the toe off, and uh, it healed, got better. I got back to work, and uh, that was that. But um, um, that's that's my war, war wound, <laughs> an absent toe.